already for the next bout of the evening. And this is a bantam with contest over six rounds. Now, officials for this bout, Jet 1, we have Clement Ashon, Jet 2, David Mills, and Jet 3, Nathaniel Obey. Now, introducing the boxer fighting uh, from the blue corner, and this evening sported in the black and white trunks, red gloves to match, the man with a weight of 120.3 pounds, presenting to you the boxer, Lukman Bashiru. Now, switching over to the red corner, and this is the son of the GBA president, the indefatigable Abraham Kota Nikwe. This is a boxer with a weight of 121.3 pounds with official record of uh, one fight, one win through the distance. And this is the boxer fighting out from the Chaskote Boxing Foundation. And as we speak, it's a student at Accra Aka Senior High School. It's in Form 2. Presenting to you, the boxer, Kaniqui. And the man in the center of this fight is Nikwe Kote. The excitement is already reverberating all over here at the Bukum Boxing Arena as these two boxers get ready to face each other. It is Khan Nikwe and Lukman Bashiru. Super Bantamweight contest scheduled for six rounds. Round one. It's the first round, and it's uh, Khan fighting in the uh, blue strip. His opponent, his opponent uh, Lukman, is in black. Lots of uh, movement in the uh, ring. Khan, the aggressor. Tries to close in on the uh, Lukman. Looks like uh, they got entangled. And Lukman looks a very steady boxer. Guard well up. Lots of bouncing around by Khan Nikwe. Taking a look at uh, these two boxers, uh, talking about the confidence level, talking about the skill-wise, you can see that one boxer is totally going to be dominant in this fight. In the name of Khan Nikwe, he's known to this platform for a couple of fights here throughout season one, and he's doing it in season two. The confidence level is very key here. Lukman Bashiru, for me, in terms of confidence and skill wise i'm not seeing that though it's early stages but let's see what happens but if this fight ends prematurely prince i wouldn't be surprised well knowing khan and the way he's oozing with a lot of confidence going into this uh, about price conan lukman bashiru didn't quite get him the way he wanted follow-up has not been as aggressive as uh, he would have wished. Still trailing him though. There was a punch that really, really caught Lukman Bashiru there. Uh, which I think Khan Nikwe is to learn how to finish up fights. That is something we've been talking all and on and on. Most of our Ghanaian boxers needs to learn how to finish up fights. It's a good one there from uh, Khan. 
more than he's doing. He needs to do uh, more than he's doing, uh, more than he did in the fir first round. Here we go for round two. It's scheduled for six. Super bantamweight between Khan Nikwe and Lukman Bashiru. Lukman Bashiru in black. Man tries to connect twice, just can't get the target. Khan moves very swiftly on his feet. Wild miss there from uh, Bashiru. And again. Nikwe keeping his eye on the uh, on the target. Well, uh, Prince in boxing, we, we, we say that he has good eyes. I mean, he's almost always seeing the the opponent's uh, 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 blow coming, and he will have to jump back. And you know, one interesting thing about Khan, I see him jumping all around, and I wonder what kind of training he is. That he looks to be very 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 fit very very strong jumping all around yeah and uh, trying to avoid uh, punches from from lukeman and for lukeman despite everything he has some some swift moves he moves so fast so it's difficult getting him to he is moving fast although he's not getting there his blows to can he's ensuring that he will not stand for for um uh, can equate to also get him connecting quite solidly there and uh, lukeman Nearly got flushed. Still bouncing around. And of course, keeping his uh, jabs uh, coming through. Combination of uh, punches to the uh, head. Lukman. Corner. Staying very glued to the action that's happening. Next, once again, to the head of uh, Lukman. Tries to work through the inside can. It's not had the uh, positive effect that he uh, he wishes for. Still keeping the pressure as he goes through. Tries the follow up with the, uh, the left. And then comes forward. Again, the timing for that left of his has not really delivered. As we gradually get to the end of this round. Exploits we have two. in the youngster uh, Khan Nikwe. Sorry, round three. As the third round is scheduled for six. And uh, it's... Uh, Kanikwe in blue and uh, Bashiru Lukman Bashiru in uh, black so right from the first round Khan has been you know doing a lot of the movement in the ring he's been bouncing in here and there he's been landing some pretty good jabs as well but from the exploits of Khan that you have uh, followed, especially in the ring, training regimen and what he goes through, what, 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 what kind of weapon do you think he has that he can use to his advantage? Yeah, even, even before we look at his, his in-ring performance, we look at the kind of sparring sessions he has been having at a Charles Sporty Boxing Gym where they have an avalanche of uh, crack boxes, the likes of Emmanuel Maule, who we saw um, uh, a while ago, um, we also have Akai Nete, who is the national flyweight champion. So they have a lot of crack boxes that um, um, Khan Nikwe, young Khan Nikwe, uh, Nikwe, the son of the GJ president, has been sparring with. And looking at his, he, uh, his in ring exploits, he looks to be um, a boxer puncher. Of course, he's a southpaw. He's not really a heavy puncher. He's not really a heavy puncher. But he There's confusion uh, in the corner of uh, uh, Lukman. Not too sure whether they are unwilling.
to get uh, Lukman continue the fight. But anyway, the referee says he should continue, and Kanikwe is taking advantage. And he's now seeing Lukman as a kind of a punching bag. He is having a free aim. Corner seemed to have uh, settled, and so I'm sure that Lukman would want to uh, continue the fight while the coach comes up. temporary halt and uh, well the gloves are off the gloves are off Lukman Bashiru has given up and proud to this I'm sure you also noticed it they, they, they were agitating that they wanted the boxer to stop like in, in, in your humble opinion and from what we're seeing uh, on the screen, do you think Lukman was in some form of difficulty somewhere along the line? He definitely, he, he, he was finding it difficult to defend himself. Uh, 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 it looked like every punch that um, that can threw was landing on his face, and he had no. On Max TV, today is a beautiful day, week number four. Of season number two of the Ghana Professional Boxing League. Gone by was a super bantam with contest over six rounds. It's ended prematurely in round number three. We have the verdicts. So before the verdicts, shall we put our hands together for the two boxes? So one of the boxes I just left the ring. Now we have the verdicts. Now we have the verdicts in round number three. Two minutes seven seconds the winner by a technical knockout presenting to you the students from Accra Akka Senior High School the man Kanikwe me how are you I'm good you know many people say you look very handsome your father though is the GBA president a student of a cracker and you've got into boxing why because i want to be a world champion you see um box okay you see um i'm not doing boxing because of anything but it's a way to start life you understand we make big money from boxing so i want to engage myself in it you understand that's good from two right yeah man what course are you pursuing um business business wonderful shall we put hands together for him so can after fighting today you've won your two professional bouts so what are we looking forward to seeing you uh, more fights to come i'm preparing with my coaches my dad so more fights to come and as we are moving tougher fights will be coming and i'm ready for everybody wonderful wonderful oh well oh that he, he he wants to fight kanikwe oh tano kalano hey minewo off you ready? Oh, turn up, Kalano. Off you ready? So now, oh, 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 chef, oh, oh, my chef, me ta, can she be na? Oh na, me ta must stop it. We are sure. If you're serious. Can you my job? Thank you very much. Can, have you heard it? Yeah. So, what, what is your message to him? Be like a shield, we bany bolo. I be like a bany bolo. Fine. My job. Let's put hands together for Kanikwe. So that is beautiful.